on this hike, we saw people panning for gold throughout yeah. it, and it was which was kind of crazy. There's just like guys there who <laughs> they're who, still doing it. Who kind of look? This is a like, California thing. That's people, what people do people this here. Came here for I, in in elementary school. I did this like like they took us like a like a field trip and we we panned for gold. Like fucking prison yeah. workers. Kind of. They yeah. said yeah. cough no, it I up. Didn't, I never really thought about they it. They cough it up. Yeah, they had these, and like, we didn't get to keep what we mined. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They had these big you know the like hammers and they're and they're flipping over and cracking rocks and That's have a awesome. little uh, this like uh is it called a is it called a salute? Dude, we don't. Okay. Do we? we we I think we've done woman. enough today. What the hell, dude? With the topics. I think you're being I thought a, you little, were sex positive. a little much. They're searching, they're searching for gold <laughs> with, with their, their contraptions. And, and we got to the car, and, and Don B was talking about it. He's like, dude, imagine, imagine being back in the day and, and finding gold for the first time. And you just have your dopamine receptors haven't been wrung out yet. By, by CS cases and loot boxes. <laughs> it's just pure dopamine for the first time in your like 28 year old life. <laughs> and, and that's a moment we'll never have. <laughs> Miles always does this shit. <laughs> I was thinking about the young, the young people looking at Dracula Flow birthday TikToks. <laughs> they're, just getting, they're just getting the just, dopamine yeah. wrong. Just out trying of to them. get a drop from the rag. Just <laughs> This is very similar to the Great Nut. This is a dude. It's funny. Miles will do this thing where you're like, "Well, we'll talk about a lot like different stuff." And so a lot of times we'll talk about like humor among young people or whatever. And uh, and but he'll always take it to this crazy place. Where you're like, "Yeah," and then I'm like, "Do you think that some of them are just like empty inside and like until they die they'll never know happiness?" I'm like, no, Miles. No, what the fuck fine, are you talking dude. about? <laughs> it's he's in this phase right now <laughs> where he'll just go right to the end of true, 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 true. <laughs> oh yeah, true. We oh, we wait. saw. Oh, oh, sorry, go ahead, go ahead. I, we we saw at the the end of this hike. This hike was really far away. It was called Bridge to Nowhere, and we uh we we get to the very end of it. Finally, it took so many hours. We hiked for six hours today, what and the fuck? And, a, and twelve miles. How much water you bring? We brought two like gallon jugs of water and oh, we quite a lot. went through all of it. Um, and at the end of the trail, we're nearing the end, but it's been way further and harder to get there than we thought because there's keeps. We had to ford a river over and over and over again to do the hike. And we didn't know that. So we're soaked. Like from the waist down, oh, yeah, we're so too. wet so and like socks, miserable. shoes destroyed. Like, and none of us knew this. And there's ropes because the water gets so deep and the current's so heavy. You have to hold the ropes to like get across the sections of the river each time you do Whoa, it. Oh, it sounds fun if you're ready for it. And it was kind of it was kind of dope, even though it was it ended up being difficult. And the trail is all fucked up. It's really hard to find your way. So we keep having to double back. At one point, one of the gold miners tells us that the trail is to the right, up like by these power lines. And we follow this for maybe 30 minutes and get to a dead end. Realize that he's just raw trolled us and have to turn <laughs> all the way back. All the way back. None of my gold they will have. Like, ignore him. Was he about yay tall? Maybe a big green hat? Did he, was he wearing overalls with one of the straps laying against his stomach? Did, he, did, he he, did it rhyme when he told you where to go? It came with a riddle. <laughs> and and we, so we've come all the way back. It's taken so long to get to the top of the hike. And we think about we've we've thought about turning around a, a bunch on the way, but we're we're surely if we if we get to the end, we'll see this beautiful bridge that the expectation is we'll be at that like scene in Stand By Me where the kids are like on the bridge with the train. Yeah. Like, and it's going to link like these two canyons together. That is loosely what we all have in mind. <laughs> and we get to the we get to because that's kind of what one of the pictures They're at the like. mirage part of this whole thing. <laughs> yeah. And and we get around the corner to the top and we start seeing these signs that say no drones allowed this is no longer like la so you had to turn around yeah, yeah you gotta go your friends can go <laughs> and, I, fuck, we're the and same i'm like i'm an emotionless <laughs> husk and i feel no shame so I, i'll stay here i'll stay here now and i uh it, it's private property instead of the the park now and there's all these warning signs about how we're being surveilled, don't use drones, and they repeat these signs over and over and over again. It feels very ominous. And you get over to the left, and there's an outhouse there that's, like, locked up that you can't use. And then behind the outhouse, and you can see the beginning of the bridge that is the end of the hike in the distance. Between the bridge and the outhouse is this giant 
like set of green like shipping containers that have clearly been turned into like some sort of like thing you can enter like there's doors and things on it called the format and where and and there's a bunch of warning signs and like a what looks like an electric fence around it no spawn trapping. and it's like absolutely like no trespassing warning about like how to prosecute you how to take advantage of you immediately we go to work on what's inside this mm. and it, it, because this is this is private property and this could I, and the conclusion we came to is that this is the ultimate incel no fap man <laughs> who, who has set up his goon cave this is the goon commander's the, <laughs> headquarters has set up his goon cave at the end <laughs> of a 12 mile hike and where where in order to break his law of personal <laughs> celibacy he has to hike in ford rivers to get to his setup which is just <laughs> pornography filled monitors where he's allowed to be one time and he has to return home <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I can I can see Miles instantly concocting, this. lighting up to this. Dude, bit. He, he's just he has this penchant for like seeing something like this and being like, "There's a gooner in there." <laughs> <laughs> and it almost made we finally it almost made what was the worst ending to any hike I've ever done worth it because we continued the next like 200 feet to the bridge. And it's just the lamest stone bridge you've ever seen. Wow. And we cap up our hike of the bridge to nowhere with the worst view imaginable and then immediately begin hiking home. We what, didn't even what was, stay. What was, this, uh, what was this hike called? Br- bridge to nowhere. Hey, you're confused. You got lost. Get fucked. Get <laughs> absolutely really? fucked. Really? I, just I can't think- say John Wayne poopy and I have to take... <laughs> <laughs> and I have to take that. Know, Did you not think you were gonna die? Miles was, Miles came home shook. It was harrowing. It was because we kept <laughs> getting lost because yeah. the trail was fucked up, and also we encountered God, the, the bridge keeps going nowhere. We encountered a large, very loud rattlesnake. No shit. Yeah, you saw it. Yeah, dude, that's cool. You should have fucked with it. You should have fucked with it. It was it was the first time I've seen a snake, like a rattlesnake, make noise other than its rattle you should and it was very oh, loud oh my god yeah dude it was that's fucked up i don't know if i think it's because we worse. got we didn't see it at first and it wasn't on the trail so i've seen a few before <laughs> hiking but they'll be on the trail and you just you just give it its space dude that's scary he yeah, wanna, that would he, scare the fuck he out doesn't want to fuck with you you don't want to fuck with him he kind of wants to fuck with you. This guy wants to fuck with you. This guy fuck with you. This is my bag, baby. This guy, <laughs> the book. Like if we're walking past this, and my legs right here, he was hiding in a bush. So we stepped next to the bush, and there's this loud, like fucking hiss, shake sound Dude. from the bush, and it was, and we all like. I know we had them, little guys. I, yeah, we like, got a fucking ton of them. I've never seen one. 